What up, what up, people? What's good? This is your favorite boy, Star Boy Whiskey, and I welcome you to my day in the life, exclusive on my favorite channel and TV base. Over the next 30 minutes, we are gonna catch all the behind the scenes action that went down at my recent London show. Trust me, this is one show you don't want to miss. Yeah. I will show you the money. Baby, dance from you. Baby, move from you. Don't go from you. Hey, what's up, Africa? It's your girl Stephanie Coker here, and I am in London, England. Yes, for a very special reason. Our very own Niger boy, Star Boy Wizkid, is going to be performing tonight, and he has invited us to follow him around for the day. I am super, super excited. Stay with us, and I will be taking you around. It is a day in the life of Wizkid. Let's go. Well, why I decided to do another concert in London was because um, the last time I did my concert in London was two years ago. And after I did that, I've pretty much just been performing at festivals. Like I did the Wireless Festival, you know, I did the BBC One Extra. Um, I did, I supported Tiny Tempo on tour as well in London and in Manchester. And um, the album just dropped and I was just like, why not? because I'm about to watch him backstage perform, um, well not perform, it's his rehearsals. Rehearsal, Sorry, you guys yeah. got a bit more time to wait. Yeah. Um, but what do you love about Wizkid? Do you love Wizkid? Yeah. Why do you love him? He's a very inspirational artist. He helps a lot of people in terms of in the music industry. Um, also talented, cute, yeah. Emphasis on cute. All right guys, well I'm gonna get some, uh, go, go backstage and check out the cuteness. I want you to be my lady. I'm making us with a spray as funny. I wouldn't say my fans in London are different from my fans everywhere else in the world. My fans everywhere really just go hard for me and I really do appreciate that like from the bottom of my heart. It's like Tim Whiskey is a family. It's like we're just one big family, you know. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm here with Wizkid's official DJ, my beloved DJ exclusive. <laughs> So you've been on you've been on all the shows, the tours, the, the, everything. The money banger shows, the ones. Yes. That <laughs> so what is it you love about these concerts? Um, just watching him on stage, seeing how people are yelling and screaming, and then when we get back home, seeing the other side of Wiz. What's fact, the other side of Wiz? Let's say Ayo, because our home is Ayo. So um, the side of him is just laid back, playful, um, eating, uh, jumping around, um, you know, chilling with the boys, the producers, legendary Malik. Um, just, he's a very playful guy, very happy guy, I have to say, you know. <laughs> my son is singing the lyrics to my son. I don't know if you guys can hear this, I'm sure you guys can. <laughs> <laughs> my son, my son is singing your mama is looking at that money. <laughs> he wants to be like that. He wants to be like that. He wants to be like that. Well, if my son ends up being an artist, that's more money for me, man. I just signed him on Star Boy. Bang, life contract with Star Boy. That's it. We keep it in the family. I'm not going to sign any artist again. Me and my son, turn up. <laughs> It's great to be out here, you know, the sound is working well, the microphone is working well, um, you know, the dancers are very, very great, the band he's using as well, they're singing so well, they're playing the music so well, um, and of course the equipment for the DJ is incredible, so it is a movie, it's, uh, it's a great show, it's going to be a great show, um, and I can tell he's excited, I can yeah. tell, you know, he's been up and about. I was in rehearsals and I already felt like I was already like watching yeah, him it perform. Like it was yeah. like a show. This is my to be one of Wizkid's dancers. What do you guys think? Maybe not, maybe not. <laughs> 
I do select my dancers myself when I go on stage sometimes. Um, and the criteria is she has to be African, number one. <laughs> and um, number two, she has to know how to dance, obviously. And um, number three, maybe she has to have a big lights or something. I don't know, maybe. That's not bad if she does have a big behind, but I'm so good. Don't be scared. How was that? Don't do that. Bad, right? That's the only way I was going to get him to talk to me after this <laughs> rehearsal. But great rehearsal. You've described the show as being like a movie. Yeah. Right? So what can we expect from this show? Um, a whole lot of surprises, you know, like proper performance. You know, I just want to have fun with my fans, to be honest. I really don't care. I'm just here to have fun with my fans. Team Whiskey. you already know that we are going to turn up. Yes, we are. Team Whiskey. And now, obviously, we have Chidima here. Yeah. And she's also going to be performing me with you. She's sexy Chidima. She flew in last night just for me. Wait, are you so love for Chidima, you know that, right? Yeah, we remember I'm you had a crush. Chidima tonight. Don't even get it twisted. I got my ring, man. I got the ring right here. Chidima, do you want this kind of ring? Is this the kind of ring you want? Come on, this is a serious ring, you know? No. Diamonds and... You have to get it. You want more diamonds? <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, Chidima didn't accept my proposal just yet. Maybe because it's my fault, because I haven't gotten the ring yet, but <laughs> you know, I'm working, I'm working towards that so I can get her some icy stuff, like, you know, what I got. <laughs> Me and Chidima, married for life. Chidima, any kids on the way? Hmm. I have plenty, if you want. How, how many do you want? <laughs> how many do you, can you, can you afford to have? How many? As long as, me, I'm ready. As long as you can take care of them, it's okay. Ah, oh, oh, okay. now, you know that. Oh, yeah. oh, money no be problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great stuff. Yeah, big shout out to you guys, man. Thanks for coming out, MTV. Big Thank shout out to my... Mm -hmm. Aww, he's so sweet. <laughs> Just joking, man, but um, I love Chidi Mama. Now, someone just proposed to you. Apparently, you are getting married. Please. But what, you're going to be performing. Don't take that seriously. <laughs> okay, all right, fine. We'll stay off blogs. Not interested in you guys. Blogs, no stories. All right, so back to the show. You're going to be performing. Now, how is it? Have you performed with Kid before? You have? Um, Yes, I've performed with him before. In London? Not in London. So this is like, uh, I'm sure it's going to be fun. Yeah. yeah. It's always fun. Yeah. Performing with him. Yeah. Uh, yeah, definitely he's my friend, so it's always... He's her friend now. What's wrong with you? He's her friend now. He's, he's always been my friend. <laughs> Hi guys, so we are off. Well, he's off quickly. Um, but, but before he goes, let's take a selfie. I take selfies. I'm easy, man. Whenever I'm in London, I just really ride around in the white Bentley. I just, it's just cool, isn't it? <laughs> in it. <laughs> Say hi to you guys. Thank you so much for sticking with me. You know, um, just finished sound check. About to kill the show. Just Going back to the on. hotel to change, and we're coming back to turn up. Turn Big up. shout out to you guys. Thank you guys for coming. Thank you, MTV. That's it for part one for my day in the life special. Don't go anywhere, cause I got lots more coming. Right after the break. Welcome back, people. If you just tuned in, you just missed all the madness that went down at my London show. But don't worry, keep it locked, because I got lots more coming. Just left the hotel now, changed, dressed up, ready for the show. When I went to the venue to go and turn up, you already know how we skip. And your boy, Wizzy Baby, does it. People still pass in my guy. The thing 
about the city of London that I really love so much is the people. Like, Africans are still Africans in London. Do you understand? It's like, everywhere you go, Africans are Africans. Like, they're not trying to be anyone else. So it's like, you're in, you're in London, but you're with your people. So like, um, that vibe and everything else I'm about London, man. Beautiful girls. <laughs> I love London. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm gonna go and check out WizKids Dancers. Hot girls. Hello ladies. You know, I could like join his dancers. He made me do a little booty shake. Yeah, he did. Um, yeah, really. So, what do you guys think? Do you think I'd be a good, you know, for well, WizKid? You can show them what you can do. I don't think I can do that. Yes, you can. <laughs> right, so what is it you guys love about dancing for WizKid? Oh, we love his energy. His energy on stage is great. It's our first time performing with WizKid, but we've oh. been on sets of his videos and right. stuff. So, um, yeah, the energy so far, rehearsals, everything's been fantastic. And what are you looking forward to the most from this concert? I'm going to be like, the bad one on stage, you know, giving it all a... <laughs> Are you gonna dance it? If I show you my money. <laughs> okay, Brenda. Brenda, what are you gonna be? What? Um, you look like you're I'm gonna just, be I'm, a princess. I'm, 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 no, I'm, I'm just gonna be me. Okay. She's gonna be bad. She's gonna be a princess. <laughs> I'm so gonna be like a diva. Like, uh, can I have some water, please? That type of thing, you know? I doubt you get any water on stage, but good luck with that. All right, thanks, Thank guys. You. Have a good Bye. one. Bye. 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 All right, so we're here with Kids Concert, and apparently it's supposed to be like a movie. But what are you guys expecting from the concert? Liveliness, jumping, everybody busting a move, you know. All right, so what is it? But what is it you love about with Kids music in general? I, I like music that has like energy and um, a feeling and a character to it, and I feel like he brings that as well, man. And this bring and it's cro clearly crossing over to the UK as well as Africa. Do you know what I mean? So, man, congratulations to Wiz and his success. Are you guys going to be doing any music with WizKid soon? Yeah, man, hopefully we link up and make some bangers, man, some hits. Yeah. Some hits. Yeah, WizKid's the guy. I would say the only thing unique about the London crowd is the fact that this is like a bunch of Africans. When is WizKid? It's Team WizKid, Africans, you know, whites, black, Jamaicans, everywhere, like everyone together in the same room. So it's just like, it's a culture. But yeah, I love London, man. There's, there's just something about London. I really, really love London. I really can't put in words to explain how much I love London. Say, if you know, you have been misplaced, I say, let me hear you say, yeah? There's always one song, you know, that one song that you just always have to perform. Like, I perform it everywhere, Africa, the US, the UK, no matter where I'm at. Everyone wants to hear Dondo. It's like, that's a ritual. <laughs> Yeah, before I perform, I definitely have to say a prayer with my clique. Like, we just say a little prayer before I go on stage every time. And I'm, I do get nervous sometimes. I'm not going to lie. Like, oh, I come to see whiskey. Ah! <laughs> Don't put that in there, I'll kill you. <laughs> Well, um, what I love about performing live is the fact that I can switch up the music. It doesn't sound the same way you hear it on a CD or the same way you see the videos. Like, I can switch it up, I can have fun with my band and have fun with the fans as well. So, like, I really love performing live. <laughs> Whenever I'm on the road, 
you're definitely going to see um, Malik Berry, LAX, Legendary Beats on the road with me at some point because I love working. Like, I never stop working. So I, I take the studio everywhere I go. Like, we have a mobile studio we take everywhere. Like, I'm in my hotel room, we just set up. Backstage, we set up, we record. That's how crazy it is. Where's Malik Berry? Yo, Malik! So wise. Yo, make some noise for Malik Perry real quick. Oh, yeah! Always had to be with my team, so whenever you see me, man, you already know the Starboy crew have to be with me. So big shout out to all my clique. <laughs> Kid. Yeah, man, it's crazy, man. Whiskey is talented. Starboy crew is talented. Everybody, we are working, so it's crazy, man. It's Whiskey, man. Whiskey is, is Africa. Whiskey has Africa. He owns Africa, man. So, you know, I'm blessed to be part of it, man. Yeah. Now, Il, yeah. what is it you love about Whiskey's music? Whiz is undoubtedly the most charismatic artist in Nigeria. Like, I mean, look at the crowd now. It's top down, from top down. Everybody's all sold out for him. I think he has an amazing character. He's always a helpful artist, always ready to help you out, you know, with collaborations and stuff. You know, I think he's a king. I mean, tonight just crowns everything. He actually proposed to Chidima. I was there, yeah. So, um, do you think they would make a great couple? If it you know, yeah. it's real. Like seriously, Wizzy has has a soft spot for Chidima, you know, and he always reflects, you know. So that's why I would fly all the way from night just to come and support his act, you know. So I think they look great together, you know. And Wizzy said he's gonna marry her. Go ahead, <laughs> I give her to you. <laughs> Sign sealed and delivered. The blessing from Ill Bliss. Ill Bliss, the boss. Chidima, I love your swag tonight, by the way. Really? Yeah. Where's your hat? Oh my gosh. Oh, I dropped it. You dropped the hat. Yeah. It was very like Brooklyn, bowler yeah, house, really know. nice. And I, I look really English. Yeah, very English. She <laughs> did. So you just performed. How was that? It was awesome, guys. The crowd was so lively. The highlight for me for the London show was me coming out and just seeing the crowd. Like we sold out, so that was a great thing. That was a great feeling for me. To be honest, I love being on stage. Yeah. <laughs> I wish I could just record and perform and that's it, like, don't have to do anything else, like, nothing, just record and perform, record, perform, that's it, like. <laughs> now, how is it working, you know, well, you're on the same label, so one minute he's in America, next week he's in the UK. Seriously, he was supposed to be in the studio with me, then he put up a picture and he was with Chris Brown in the studio. Oh, did, did, did you for Chris Brown? Yeah, I, I understood it, it's all right. All right, so but, uh, how are you loving the concert so far? It was amazing, man, it's amazing that obviously we can, bring Afrobeats to the UK in such a manner, do you see what I'm saying? A lot of people have tried before, but as this third we learned, we've managed to package it and do it properly, do you see what I'm saying? And Wizkid obviously playing the most important role in that as the amazing artist that he is. How about I sum up the entire show? I would say the show is just exciting and different, you know, and I really do appreciate everyone that came out that night. One thing I was gonna say, yeah, like, what I'm reading about with this crowd is like, I looked around, there's nothing but female. Yeah, yeah, too many bottles, man, you already know. <laughs> Do you know why I'm so out of breath and I can't talk right out? It's because Wizkid just gave an amazing, out of this world performance on stage. How did you enjoy the show? You, I know, remember before we spoke about it and you said it was going to be like a movie. So did it live up to expectations? Yeah, yeah, of course, man. My fans were happy. Everyone was happy. It was an amazing show. Uh, my sister was in the crowd, my family, my friends, you know, everyone, man. And that's like, that's an amazing feeling. I can't even explain how much joy that gives me. So I just want to say a big shout out to my fans for coming out tonight. Every song I had fun, man. Everyone was going crazy. That's it, people. That was all the madness that went down at my London concert. I hope you enjoyed watching A Day in the Life as much as I enjoyed shooting it. I really cannot wait to rock London again, but it's time for me to bounce. It is your favorite boy, Starboy Whiskey, signing out.
have a crush anymore. I'm married. I love MTV. MTV loves me. Come on, too, Larry. Come on, yeah. Not the. Take, you can take I'll the boy out of the hood. All right. But you can never take the hood out of the boy. See you later till I die.